Hey, hey guys, guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we will be talking about what's in our diaper bags. And we'll be starting off with me. Okay, so my diaper bag is Steve Madden, and I got it for a gift. I think it was for Nuffy's baby shower or her first birthday. Okay, so in this first pocket right here, I normally just keep my phone. Which is messed up. Yeah, because not, uh, I was, I had Nathie one day and she threw it from the second floor in her house and it cracked and now it's like <laughs> blinking. Yeah. <sighs> the struggle. With toddlers. Okay, and then in the second um, thingy zipper. And then on this part, I keep her wipes and then a few diapers. And then it has a pocket here, which I normally keep her bottle, which she has right now to calm her down with her dad. And then on this side, I keep water. And then on the big one, I have a really big mess right now. <laughs> and I just have a whole bunch of stuff that I feel that I normally need for her when I go out with her. Because she does have two different diaper bags. She has one that I take for her babysitter which is her grandma and that normally just has diapers clothes and wipes because her grandma has everything else that she needs in case if she's sick or anything and then so i normally have eucerin which is for her eczema because she does get bad eczema especially during the winter time i notice it that's worse so i have to make sure i carry this around because i put it on her about three times a day and then i do have a whole bunch of snacks which are which she loves because she loves eating. <laughs> and I have these yogurt melts, um, mixed berries, and then the Little Crunch, the ranch. And then I have this strawberry snack bar and Cheetos. <laughs> I have a whole bunch of snacks. And then I have my planner. And then I also have my wallet in here. Okay, and I also have boogie wipes because she has been sick recently. She's been having fevers and pink eyes, so I have to make sure I carry everything that I need around. And then in this little bag, I carry around mostly all her medications and everything I need. So I have this Baby Gannix Cold Relief Chest Rub, and you just open it. And you don't even have to put your finger on it to just rub it like this. And it smells really good. Does it actually work? Yeah. It smells just like this. Mm -hmm. And then I have hand sanitizer. This is from it... Bot... Bed Bath. No way. Bath, Bath and Body Works. And it's magic in the air. It smells really good. And I normally keep this because Ever loves when his hands smell good. It's not even for me. <laughs> And then I have this Germex natural hand sanitizer spray. And I like this like for nut for nutty. It smells like vanilla. I didn't even know that. Yeah. Okay, and then I have this to check her temperature whenever I feel like she's really warm. And then I have Tylenol for fever. And then I have this healing cream, baby three in one diaper rash. Where she barely gets diaper rash, but just in case. And then I have the Zarbi's um, cough syrup with dark honey. And then syringes for the Tylenol. What else do I have? Oh, I have a Smarties. Smarties? Or Sweet Tarts. <laughs> okay, and then I also have this Olay sample thing. I don't know where I got it from or how long it's been in my bag. But it's here. And it's for visible wrinkles. It's for her visible wrinkles. <laughs> you know, you guys start early. <laughs> okay, and that's pretty much it. That's everything that I have on my diaper bag. Okay. Now, I have the Timmy and Leslie diaper bag that I bought when, before I had my first son, Isaac. I bought it at Bye Bye Baby. Um, okay. So, it has two pockets in the front. Well, technically four, but I only use like the zippered ones. And then it has like these other two. 
<clears throat> so on this one, on this one right here, I have the Munchkin pacifier wipes for my newborn because he uses pacifiers. Isaac, my toddler, doesn't use pacifiers, but he'll take away Ivan's uh, pacifier and like throw it everywhere and put it in his mouth sometimes. So I have to clean it and I use it. And then I have the boogie wipes because you know it's that time of the year where they get congested and you need it. <laughs> and then in this pocket I have the A and D, a huge thing of A and D diaper rash cream. I haven't used it, but just in case, I couldn't even find a small one. But I don't know. So I have this just in case. And then I have a bib that I have to wash. I think. I don't know. And then I have this cloth to clean when baby's feeding. And I have this um, booger sucker thing. And that's all that's in that pocket. And that's all that's in that pocket. So the back one here, this one's broke. It's broken. I broke it. I don't know how. I can't fix it. But usually I have my phone in here. And that's it because I'm scared that anything's going to fall out. And my, my phone. I don't know. You but it's right here. I do <laughs> care about it. But I don't know. I usually just carry it in there. I don't know. Okay. On the inside. Looks like this. You can't really see. But it has a huge pocket in the back with the, also a zipper pocket. I don't know. You can't even see it. Um, it has that and then it has five pouches for whatever you want to put in it and then the middle obviously. And so first thing I have is this this thing I got from Walmart that carries you can it has two sections. So in the first one right here, I have a pacifier. I also have <laughs> If you guys can hear my son in the background running around, you guys will probably hear our kids a lot. <laughs> yeah. But their daddies are taking care of them, so yeah. Okay. So I have this um Braun thermometer. Um which honestly, sometimes I don't even trust it, so that's why I actually carry this other one. How do you use that one? Okay. Um, this one, the way you use it, it's, it's basically a forehead one. So you just turn it on, like that. I don't know if you guys can see, it's like yellow. And then it turns green, and then you press the button right here. So this one you actually don't even have to turn it, like touch it in the, on the, exactly on the forehead. But basically you put it between the eyebrows, a few, a little bit away, like a little, like that. Like that, I don't know if you guys can tell. So my temp is 99.3. Hey, you're warm. <laughs> <laughs> my temp is at 99.3, it's hot in here, okay? Um, so it's green because it'll show up green like and what color does it show when it has a fever? When it's a baby? When the temperature is like low, like low hundreds, like less than 101, it'll be like an orangish color. And then when it's above that, it'll be a red. So sometimes I don't trust it because I'm like, does it really go here? Because sometimes I'll put it like right here and it's like 106. And then right here it'll be like 100. So then I'll do the rectal. So then I'll do the. So you too? Because nothing moves yeah. a lot. She won't let me do it. Actually, I haven't used it on my toddler in a long time. Yeah, so that thing was like a newborn. I haven't used one of those. And yeah, I haven't used it on my newborn either. But I used to use it on my toddler, like he, when he was smaller. But I haven't used this one in a long time. Um, and then I have this little toothbrush thing that I don't even use, but my son likes chewing on it. Um, it's an entertainment. Yeah, so I just carry it. And then I have this Motrin for my toddler. 
So obviously, Ivan can't use it yet. So now in the next one, in the next one, I have, I have gripe water. This is really good for gas, colic, fussiness, and hiccups. Um, I started using this when I had Isaac, my first son. I used it because I was actually researching stuff to use for a fussy baby or gassy baby. I don't remember. But I came upon this and it works. Like, I recommend it. And then I have little remedies. Saline spray drops to get the boogies out. And I have two syringes, one for the town, uh, Motrin and one for the grape water. Okay. And then I have this big pouch. This is extra clothes for both of them. Did that come with the bag? Yeah, this came with the bag. And what I like about this bag, you guys, is that it doesn't look like a diaper bag. Because I've never really liked to have diaper bags that look like diaper bags. Because I knew I was going to be using it like a whole day, every day. Not all day, but you know. Um, and I didn't want to be carrying around a little character. I don't know. Um, and then I have this cup that his auntie Jackie gave him. And I usually just put juice in here. Um, and yeah. And then sometimes I'll have a bottle in here. Um, but I usually don't like giving him bottles now unless he's going to sleep. But sometimes he'll be really fuzzy, so I'll just give him a bottle. And then I have these wipes. Um, now these wipes were given to me as a gift from a baby shower for Ivan. Obviously not Isaac, but today that would have been almost two years ago. So Ivan, um, my mom actually gave me a gift. Actually, it wasn't for my baby shower. It was for Christmas. She gave me two big boxes of ten. And each box had ten packs of these. So I'll be using them for a while. And then I have diapers for Isaac. These are the Pampers. He's at a size five right now. So this is my favorite brand. And then I have Ivan size one. These are Huggies. These were gifts. Um, but yeah. I still like Pampers better because I don't know if he's, it's because he's a newborn. But this always leaks. I've tried other ones with him that were also gifts and they leak. But maybe it's because he's a newborn. I don't know. But he always has blowouts. So. Um, and then I have my wallet which is Olivia and Joy I don't know I just got it from Ross I think and my husband's cooking you guys so we'll see I think he's making shrimp and rice oh my gosh so then I have this bottle now this bottle is a special feeder bottle because Ivan has a cleft lip and palate. Um, I'll talk about that in another video, but basically you just squeeze it, that'll, that's how he feeds. Um, and yeah, so I have this. And I think that's it. Um, let me double check. Oh, I have the formula. He's at the Similac, he's using the Similac Pro Sensitive. Um, so yeah, and that's pretty much it. I usually carry this thing instead of like, you know, those containers that have like the sections for the formula. I usually just carry this because I never know, like sometimes we plan on just going out for a little bit. And then like if I have that thing, then I need formula. more formula. Yeah, so I always carry this just in case we go somewhere else. Um, and you know, newborns have to be feeding like every two hours, so. Yeah, and that's it, you guys. If you guys loved our video, make sure to like, subscribe, share, and comment. And actually, if you guys like this bag, I'm gonna link it down below so you guys can check, check it out. out and buy it. Um, I really like it, it's held up for almost two years and it's still in really good shape. 
And honestly, I love this bag, you guys. So if you want it, I'll link it down below. We'll see you guys in the next video.